TP in the snow, a tribute to the Ute Indians. They use this as their sacred hunting grounds in the summertime, and they call this area the land of hanging waterfalls. My guide Ashley and I make our way through Prospect Bowl. So we're on the Ute Express. What are we looking at? We're looking at Palmyra Peak, which is all skiable terrain inbounds. If you look above the first cliff bands, you can see small little bodies up there. Um, and then they follow the switchback trails to the very top of Palmyra Peak. If confidence calls your name, it's an hour and a half hike up to the top of Palmyra Peak. It's a nice hike. It's a boot kick, so you carry your skis on your pack or over your shoulder. There's a couple little spots where you don't want to slip, but I don't think it's anything too death defying or anything like that. And it's not really as hard as it looks. See what that sign says? Do not overestimate your ability to hike or ski a peak that is over 13,000 feet. If I'm not back in like three hours, go get me. You see where that uh, chimney like house chimney projection is coming off the top? Just to the right of that is where most people will drop in and ski a 2,000 foot vertical drop into Prospect Bowl. Yeah, we're not going. No way. No way, no how, no can do will I ski that drop like that guy is doing. Well, maybe someday. Ha! We are taking Galloping Goose! And wait for it, wait for it. Yes, I did just pop out of my bindings and crash. Mike, thanks for helping me. Gotta love Ski Patrol. From here, you get a great view of Wilson Peak. You may know that one. It's also known as Coors Peak and featured on Coors bottles and in commercials. So over to Revelation Bowl, where the scenery is just as breathtaking. Hello, Utah! Those snow-capped mountains in the distance are the LaSalle Mountains in Utah. Okay, where are we going? We are actually going to be skiing down to Bon Vivant, which is just at the bottom of this hill. These folks are taking the fast way down, straight down. From an elevation of 12,570 feet, we start our way down. I'm going to go sideways down just a little bit. When in doubt, <laughs> sidestep. Once comfortable on one of my first double blue runs ever, I cruise down Woosley Way. Check out my view. Talk about having to work for your lunch, but the French cuisine at Bon Vivant on the mountain is worth it. Jennifer Broom, Fox 31, Denver.